Hey everybody, it's Trey Shy Guy, and welcome back to Undertale. Last time we got to this dog. Oh, who are you? I might have talked to you. Oh wait, yeah I did. X, okay. We're gonna go this way. Oh god, my puzzles. Ah! Uh, it's Snow Pyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word Sands written on it in red marker. Great. Okay. One. Two. It's looking like I need to get um, that, and that, that X in the middle to be my last one. And I see how I can do it. No! God damn it. Wait. <laughs> Crap. Um, okay. Here. Here. There we go. I friggin' hit the wrong button. There. Now we have a bridge. Oh god, this doesn't look ominous at all, guys. I had a hat. What if I go back through? Another hat. I can't control my direction when I'm in there. I guess I. There's someone in there making me a hat. It's a snow puff. Wait, what's down here? That's sand. That's probably where I have to go. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold! A snow puff! What? Oh. Well, this could be bad. It's the greater dog. Um. Um. Ignore! Great Hawk inches closer. Oh god, that face! And it's on his spear, too. Oh god, bark, 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 bark. Oh, he's gonna hit me. Great Dog just wants affection. Um, um. Check. Great Dog, attack 15, defense 18. It's so excited that thinks fighting is just play. Bark, 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 bark. Okay, um, back in. The, dark, the gray dog's ears perk up. Nothing else happens. Park, park, ow. Park, park. Park, park, ow. Um. Play. Good. The gray dog is not excited enough, excited enough to play with. Park, park. Park, park. Park, park. Pet. Gray dog curls up in your lap as it as it is pet by you. It gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Zzz. Then it wakes up. It's so excited. Bark bark. Bark bark. Bark bark. Play. You make a snowball and throw up with the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Great dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now dog is very tired. He rests his head on you. Oh god! Great Dog wants some TLC. TLC. I forget what TLC means. Crap. TLC? Spare. Ah. TLC? Um. Um. Play. Um, TLC, um, pet. As you pet the dog, it sinks its, its entire weight into you. Your movement's slow, but you still haven't pet enough. Oh god! Bark, bark! Bark! Fuck! Well, pet capacity is 40%. Um, 
Um, ice cream. Love yourself. I love you. You recovered 15 HP. Oh god. Uh, pet more. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with his leg hanging in the air. Oh shit. Gray dog is contented. Oh my god, I can spare him. What's up, greater dog? That's the wrong way, but okay. I guess we're going this way. I feel like sand, because like I saw sands the other way. And I assumed that was the way I had to go, but now that there was a boss over here, so I'm gonna try this. Now sands is gone. Oh, that could be bad. Give fraught. Um, check. Give fraught. Attack 16, defense 8. Some teens decorated it as a prank. Oh, go ahead and laugh. Oh, my God. Ah, sent a fresh pine needles. Undecorate. You remove the Linux here, bookmark of a smoke team winking. That's a little better. There! <laughs> Give a slightly less here to hit. Undecorate. You remove the box of non dog related raisins. That's a little better. Uh. Um. Gift. You give 35 G because you can't think of an appropriate gift. Oh, you shouldn't have. I can spare you, but I can I want to get the flavor text for decorating. Decorate. You had some googly eyes and you found it on the ground. I was starting to trust you! Oh god. No! Undecorate. Move the googly eyes. Thanks for nothing. Oh crap. Oh god, I'm so dead. <laughs> um, bandage. Leave me alone. Oh god. Oh, I can spare you still. Here you go. Uh, hey, a cave. This seems like a bad idea. That's an hour. Attacks, okay. This could be bad. Also, I just realized I forgot my, to set my timer for the episode. It's a door. What are these? It's a door. I don't know what to do here. Um, I'll see you later. Well, now we can come back anyway. Any more new enemies? Anyway, we're gonna go this way now. I just hope I don't run too far over time because I don't have a timer set for this episode. This doesn't look inc inconspicuous at all. Am I gonna get, am I gonna get another hat? A virus and sands. Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge! Behold! The gauntlet of deadly terror! Is that a dog? When I say the word, it will act it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it! Well, let's hold up. Hold up? What hold up? I'm, I'm about to activate it now! That, uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems, maybe, too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all! Away it goes. Phew! 
What are you looking at? This is another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah! Heh. Heh? I don't know what my brother is going to do now. How are you? I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Uh, I probably should. How much money do I have? I have lots. Well, compared to what I had before. Welcome to Snowden! I was actually just thinking about, like, is there gonna be towns? Hello, traveler. How can I help you? Uh, talk. Um. Hi. Hiya! Welcome to Snowden. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? Um, what do we do here? You want to know what to, what to do here in Snowden? Grillby ha Grillby's has food, and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They showed up one day and asserted themselves. This town has gotten, gotten a lot more interesting since then. Uh, town history. Think, think back to your history class. A long time ago, Monsters lives in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and so I became in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. It has been locked for ages. So unless you're a ghost or you can bear under the, under the door, forget about it. life. Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic. But we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles, day after day. That's life, ain't it? Okay. Bye. Tough glove. Plus two attack, so I'd be able to hit things more. Bicycle. Or... Bicycle. It was 11 HP times 2, so I'm guessing that's like a multi-use item. Um, I think I'm going to get the manly bandana and some cinnamon buns. I've been taking a lot of, H or a lot of hits. Is that something? Does this look like a pawn shop? I don't know how it works where you come from, but... If I started spending money on old branches and used managers, I'd be out of business in a jiffy. Okay, so... <laughs> I can't actually buy any- or I can't- I can buy stuff, I can't actually sell things. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Uh, I'm not gonna save, cause recording. Um... Don't want to walk in the other side of town? Try the Undersnow Tunnels! They're- they're really efficiently laid out. I'm guessing there's probably gonna be monsters though. The lady, the lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Please let that be like a toy mouse. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. <laughs> All the teens tormented by a, tormented a local monster by decorating it like its tree-like horns. So I started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. Yo! You're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. How all kids are identified. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if, there, if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish... Will t a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics! Only politics are like that in real life. Let's go on to grill, grillies. Uh, you got these are all 
You guys are bosses. We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I have just skeletons to throw us a bone. We love bones. You look terrifying. Hmm. Isn't human, human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'll have to try it sometime. That seemed... This place is like made out of wood, dude. You don't want to light it on fire, do you? Grobus said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch this stuff. Those are part of the Royal Guard. The elite military le group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. Um, it's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. <laughs> Sorry, just one more time. Hi. Right. I'm thinking of getting a spiked collar to show off my personality. Make a statement like, attach a leash to me and take me for a walk, please. Or that you're dangerous and gonna kill people that move. Capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm. I don't want to see the erasure of our local culture, but I only want to see some more city slickers slip on their butt onto their butts. The jukebox is broken. Okay. Is this a bunny head? No matter where I go, it's the same menu. The same people. Help! I want new drinks and, uh, and, and hot guys. <sighs> I didn't talk to you, did I? I want to be on uh, the country when I grow up, too. Hoo hoo hoo. But you. I put, out, I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. You do you, man. Um, we'll talk to one more person before we wrap it up for today. And I'll talk to both of them. Everyone knows I was laughing and cra cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crisis. Crisis. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything. So why be morose about it? I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, we'll, we'll check out the li library next time. See you guys then.